Hello! So today is another TSV video, Time Score Vloggers, and uh, I liked it. My views on Harry Potter and the Deathly Hazards Part 2 is that it was brilliant. Hello, this is me the next day. I'm just going to explain something. Normally, I do my Mr. Wednesday videos on a Tuesday because it's more convenient for me and I can edit them and I can just upload them quickly. But I've just finished watching uh, Joe and... Joe? Yeah. Joe's and Joe and Lewis's, sorry, I forgot his name. Rant. Oh, rant. Uh, by the way, I Joe, I love the way you say rant, because I say rant and you say rant. Language differences! Oh. Anyway, I now see what you mean. I do love the books. I've been reading them, as I said in my video. Here, I've been reading it. And it is really good, and it does give a lot of extra information, actually, like with the house elves and Winky. Like, I've been noticing as I've been reading them, they have actually got a lot more different. And uh, I'm sorry, I apologise, because in this video I don't actually talk a lot about Harry Potter, because I didn't have a lot to talk about. But now I totally see what you mean, because I haven't read the books. But from like being with Doctor Who and being disappointed because I'm very immersed in that. I know there's not a book, but I've had situations like that where I've been disappointed and I can see where I've got nothing to reference to, I can't see it. And now I actually think about it, it was a lot of unanswered questions. Now that's all I'm going to say, um, so my opinion has changed because of you. And I will read the book once I finish them all. And I will read once I've finished reading Deathly Hallows. I will watch part. Re yeah, once I finish reading Deathly Hallows, I will watch part one and two, and then I can have a rant. I will promise you, I will do a rant once I finish reading it. But I loved the movie. It was amazing. I loved all the battles. Get away from me, I dot you, bitch. Jake, you done a video on your second channel this week, and you said about how it was amazing. You had them 3D Potter glasses. Now I'm not sure whether my cinema does them because they haven't been advertising them. I really hope I can get them. Also, Jake, I told you I'd show you my scrapbook, because Jake does a lot of scrapbooks, and he talked about it on his Vida thing, and I thought, hmm, I'll give that a, I'll give that a crack. This is the first page, and it is amazing. You've got, this is who I am, me as a baby, the way it was. The next page I've devoted to just Harry Potter. You put Grint's face, levitating. Daniel Radcliffe doing that really weird smile that he should never do. I think he should have a closed smile, to be honest. Another page devoted to the man, the myth, the potter. Little Dumbledore! This is the next page, and I'll show you some highlights of this one. This is getting very dull, I'm sorry. Win! Simon Pegg. Roman Axilla! This is the tale of Captain Jack Sparrow. Next page. <laughs> next page. <laughs> yes, that's my scrapbook. I've been reading this, and it's Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, and I'm not very far in it. And, uh, yeah, because I thought I should read the Harry Potter books because uh, Lewis with his rants and everything just get on his good side now it's not because of that it's just I want to read them and it's actually really good so far I think it's the best one so far to be honest uh, I've just got up to chapter when they're getting on the Hogwarts Express and yeah it's good by the way do you like my bookmark Wait, I'll just go. first it's Harry that it turns into Ron I don't know whether you can see that but it switches from one to the other and it's from the Chamber of Secrets, which is one of the best movies. Yes, so I've been reading this at the moment. Also, I went to see Harry Potter, as you know, and I've got a little rant coming on. Why is it, people in cinemas, like, you know this is the last Harry Potter film, why take your kids there? Why? Because these people in front of us that wouldn't stop. They kept getting up and down, up and down, up and down. Daddy, can I go to the toilet? Daddy, can I go to the toilet? And my friend, who's a girl, got really annoyed. She went, they do that. And I was like, yeah, whatever. And she, um, it was the music was raising, and it was Snape's death, right? Quite a poignant moment, yeah? It was going quiet, up and up and up. And Snape was like, um, you have your mother's, Daddy, can I go to the toilet? For fuck's sake! That's what my friend said. Sorry about the language. And the mum looked around like, and, oh, it's so funny. It kind of ruined Snape's death, but... It was just a brilliant moment by my friend. Yeah, and I can't wait to see Jake's video tomorrow. Bye!